Hey there, Mission Control. What? Sorry it's been a while since my last posting. Uh, it's uh, been a lot of stuff going on in my normal job. Really good stuff. Uh, just uh, lots of work there and then coming home being exhausted and then uh, having to work on the projects just taking a toll on me. Uh, just really tired these days. So sorry again I haven't got more postings up. Kind of an interesting looking thing here, don't you think? Rotates. What could this thing be, I wonder? Well, I can tell you this, it came from oh, a 3D printer. So yeah, got a 3D printer. And uh, this is a rotary union that I designed. Um, they don't sell, I couldn't find these online. And what it is, it's a dual passage, one, two, uh, rotary. So one section stays stable. You notice my right hand left to you guys isn't moving, whereas my left hand is moving. There we go. Tack dogs on the loose here. And uh, so this is this is a a prototype that I built uh, for a, a potential airlift pump. Uh, that could be used to get fish waste out of the system. So uh, it's my first prototype, it's my first official 3D part that I've ever made, designed myself in CAD, and uh, it has some flaws in it. Uh, in fact, I already have, what is it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven defects that need to be fixed on this. Um, they make dual passage rotary uh, unions, uh, you can buy them online, but they want like $500 for them, and they're all meant for really high pressure, really uh, uh, high speed revolutions, you know, and this one is meant to be very low pressure. Uh, it'll have air going down and waste coming back up uh, into vinyl tubing, uh, quarter inch and half inch uh, outer diameter tubing, and uh, so. $500 when I need 18 of them is just ridiculous. You know, I'm not going to spend that. That's just crazy, crazy talk. So, designed one and then I did a 3D print on it. Uh, right now, what's printing is actually a shredder. Uh, found it off of Thingiverse and the idea with printing it is just I want to I want to see if the shredder concept will actually work to shred hay and to shred manure. So, this plastic shredder that I'm making, it's pretty hard plastic. I mean, that hurts, you know, it's not like it's light and or flexible. This is PLA uh, plastic. Uh, I think it, it's gonna be a really good test to see how the system, or how the shredder concept works. It's it's only gonna be about yay big. It's uh, like four inches by four inches. Not gonna be very big, but I can get some manure and get some straw, you know, little small pieces, put them in there and see what happens. So, uh, been working on that. It's, it takes days for the prints to, to go. This one's been going now for, what is it, uh, a full day actually. And it's still, it's 34% uh, complete. So it has quite a bit more than it needs to get done on it. But uh, yeah, worked on that, worked on some code. Uh, really kind of not fun stuff, just way behind the scenes, deep down in the code. Uh, on the uh, website, trying to add more capability there. Uh, added a log, a system log. Uh, to all the units, meaning that whenever they do some large action, it's now posted to the server so I can troubleshoot because we got some bugs out there. I got a temperature unit that I've discovered uh, isn't working correctly, and that's screwing up the exhaust fan so the building's getting too warm. Uh, so, gonna have to get that fixed in a hurry. What else has there been? You know, that's been pretty much it, then just doing chores and honestly just trying to survive. Just I don't know if maybe other people are in the same boat, but man, it's like 2018 has just kicked off to be a just draining, draining year. It's been really tough. So I just wanted to get this quick update. No fancy editing today, guys. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm just tired. I'm exhausted, but I wanted to get something to you so you kind of know what's going on. Some cool stuff here. Uh, I'll, I'll do I'll do more right by you. I'll get way better. You know, here's a 3D print. Here's CAD. Here's doing all this stuff. But I just wanted to show you. It is way cool. Let me show you again. Look at that. Oh, that's so cool. Zoom in. Yeah. 
So uh, that's it for this episode. Uh, short and sweet to the point. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I will try to get more videos up here as things calm down. So stick with us. We got some cool stuff coming and the plants are doing really well. Uh, except for my nemesis bed. For those that have remembered or been here for a while, you know the nemesis bed. I thought I killed it. The nemesis was dead. The nemesis returned. So we got some major work to do there. If you uh, haven't, uh, don't know what I'm talking about, do a search on nemesis in my uh, videos and you should find the bed. Oh. Anyway. Hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give us a thumbs up and hit subscribe. And don't forget, you can follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and on Patreon. In the meantime, this is The Real Martian.